Hello everybody, welcome back to a brand new episode of Dragon Age. Last episode we just came back from the Exalted Plains, if I can think that's where we came from. And Solus actually returned to Skyhold. So before we actually go into the, the next mission, Promise of Destruction, we're going to go catch up with Solus because we haven't spoken to him in a while. So let's go see what he has to say for himself. Because it looks like he's been away for quite a while. So let's catch up with the old guy. Hey buddy. Inquisitor, I was... Do you have a moment? Of course. Let's go chat. What did I say, buddy? What were you like before the anchor? Has it affected you? Changed you in any way? Your mind? Your morals? Your spirit? Uh, no, not really. I don't believe so. Ah. Why do you ask? You show a wisdom I have not seen since... Since my deepest journeys into the ancient memories of the Fade. You are not what I expected. I do love these games. They really do uh, call back to all your actions. It just goes to show what kind of character you make uh, your character to be. Sorry to disappoint. It's not disappointing. It's... Most people are predictable. But you have shown a subtlety in your actions. A wisdom that goes against everything I know of your people. Uh, I try, mate. You know, I just do what I have to do. I do what I can. You are modest. So many would use this Inquisition as a blunt instrument in their rise to power. But not you. So what does this mean, Solus? It means that I respect you deeply, Inquisitor. Oh, thank you. And I have disturbed you enough for one evening. Ah, uh, you could never disturb me, mate. You're a good lad. You know, you're a good companion and a good friend. Right, now that's done. Let's go to the war table and uh, and uh, get Cassandra's mission sorted. Right. Don't know why I did that. Uh, and I'm not going to jump all the way down there. That cannot be good for my health. So let's head down. The main hall. Come on, load up. The place is starting to look a lot lighter now. So... No, we don't need to go into the quarters. Let's uh, head here and uh, and see uh, if we can uh, get more information. Because we definitely need to finish Cassandra's mission. Okay, let's do this. Okay, guys. Let's see what we have to do. What's this? Is this it, yeah? Spider Master. Oh, okay. Nice. Got some influence. Nice. Right, let's see here. Uh, locate the missing seekers. Nothing yet. Right. What? Okay, we got it. So, what's next? Do we have to speak to Cassandra again? Or can we just go straight to the location? Uh, use the world map to travel to Casa. Okay, okay. Where to is it? Uh, is that? Yeah, there you go. Promise of destruction. Right, we got Cassandra with us, so we're going to take Barrack, and I think we will take Blackwall with us. With us. Let's go. Let's see what happened to the Seekers. Because if you remember correctly, um. Lord Seeker Lucius was uh, among the Templars, but he, his body wasn't found at Haven. So we got to try and figure out what the hell's going on, because some things are not adding up. So fingers crossed we will get some answers here. Right, explore the castle. Very peaceful here, I will say. Odd that the trail should lead us here. Is it really that bad? Pious, unassuming man. What has he become involved in? It might not be by choice. He might simply be a victim as well. Let's see what lies within. Let's see what lies within. I like the sound of that. Let's see what's here. Spindle weed. What we got here? Oh, nice. Some nice materials. Now, let's get going. Right. What's this? Have I checked in here? Heavy free army armor. Okay. 
Let's check that out. Hey on. Sorry guys, I'm just gonna check it out. Let me just double check. Ooh. That's quite nice, but it takes a lot of armor down. So that's not gonna be for me. Oh, hello. And goodbye. <laughs> Too late, we got you. Right, what's he got? Toy soldier, okay. Guess everyone has comforts. Nice. Come on, let's do this. Nice. Oh, I love that sound so much. We are doing it. Promises. I should have known. The Order of Fiery Promise is a cult with strange beliefs about the Seekers. They've hounded us for centuries. Uh, it's for strangers' what beliefs. Strange beliefs. They believe they are Seekers, the only rightful ones. They say we robbed their powers long ago, preventing them from ending the world. Ending the world? The only way to truly eradicate evil in their eyes, the world will be reborn a paradise. It's all nonsense. Why not deal with them? Why haven't the Seekers dealt with them? We have, many times. They simply reappear after a time like weeds. Nobody knows how. Can they be reasoned with? Is it possible to negotiate with them? They're fanatics, drunk on whatever forbidden magic they can find to make themselves true Seekers. This explains why the Seekers might be here, but not the connection to Corypheus. Fair play. Right, let's have a look around, see what we can find. Okay, there's nothing in here, but there's a bag there, so we'll go and have a look at that. Get out the way, guys. Let's have a look. Okay. Oh, we've got some gold and viridium. Nice. Viridium's a very good armor. A material for armor, sorry. What's this here? Loot. Let's have a look. Oh, we got some uh, paint for uh, Iron Ball. Definitely coming handy for him. A seeker. Did they torture him to death? I think the they did. The will pay for this. Damn right. Let's go take him out. We will avenge your fallen soldiers. Come on. We're all here now. Show yourselves. Kill that warrior. Kill that warrior. There we go. I'll take you all on, come on. So oh, he's always got red templars in here too. Okay. Easy. Nice. What have we got here? Courtyard key. Oh, he got stuck in his place. Guess he's not working. Oh, what do you think, Sandra? As the Seekers of Truth have proven resistant to the effects of Red Lyrium, the Elder One has seen fit to place them in your care. We claim your destiny and know that the Elder One expects your devotion as repayment. Signed by Lord Samson, commander of the Red Templars. Lord Samson. Does Corypheus not realize the promises want the world to end? What use are they to him? He sold the Seekers to them. I guess that's the main thing. So Corypheus sold the Seekers to these cultists. And they leapt at the chance, of course. But this doesn't explain how he captured the Seekers in the first place, or what's been done with them. We must keep looking. Why are the Seekers resistant, anyway? The letter said Seekers were resistant to Red Lyrium. Our abilities grant us many gifts, but the resistance to Red Lyrium's corruption? That seems strange. Although it would explain why none have numbered among the Red Templars. And thus Seekers would be useless to Corypheus. He would have no leash to hold us. You sound worried, girl. You sound worried. I am. The Seekers are my family. We'll see what happens. We'll get information out of them. Right. We're going to go into the castle in a minute. I just want to see what's in here. Maybe there's something in here we can use. Right, let's have a look. Uh, oh, we got some more elf root, velatine as well. What's this in here? Oh, short. Oh, we can't use it. Oh, oh it's a shadow hunter bow. We got. We've already got one. It's alright, guys. We don't need that. 
We've got dozens of them as it is anyway. Right, let's go and explore the castle. Let's see what we can find. I think there's nothing else out here for us to explore to anyway. So let's, yeah, let's just head straight up. And fingers crossed we'll find some more information. Right. Oh, here we go. Here they come. Nice. Oh, I freaking love that saying when they sit when the freaking the flag happens. Right, come on. You want me? I'm right here. We got you. We got you. We got you, buddy. Ow. Nice. Ow, crap. Didn't see him do it. Nice. Ouch! Right, you're gonna pay for that. Here we go. Fine, can you just do a backflip out of nowhere? Nice. There we go, that's how you take it out. One for good measure. We almost got him, we almost got him. There we go. Everyone seems to be doing alright. Right, hang on, what's happening over here? What have we got here? Oh, it's just uh, in codex. We don't we don't normally read them, guys, you know that. So let's just see what's over here. Oh, what's over here? What have we got? Let's see. Uh spike blade? No, we don't need any of those swords. We're only gonna go for epic stuff now. I'm Tell you what, Blackwood's looking freaking awesome. God, that throne, ain't that beautiful or what? Right, let's head up this way. Anything up here? Oh, there's a chest there. Eh? Let's have a look. Got some goodies in here. Uh, Seeker Shield. We'll take that. Cassandra could definitely use that. Uh, Enchanter Coat. Nice. Some reason that doesn't open. Right, first of all, we're going to uh, go back to Cassandra a minute, and we're going to swap her shield, her current shield, with the Seekers. So where to is it? There you go. Just for her. Okay, that's good. Now what we're going to do now is going to head back down the stairs because there's another. Can we go through there? Okay, we can go through there, but there's another set of stairs we haven't been up to yet, so I guess it leads up there. So if we can find what's up here, maybe we can find some extra bits and pieces that can help us. Okay, yeah, there's something over there. Hang on. That's Lyrium infested. And the coat, no, we've got one of them. I hate it when I have to jump. Right, uh, no. Well, it was worth a look anyway. You just never know. Because sometimes you do get epic stuff in uh, if the areas you've always been. Right, let's have a look. Oh dear. This doesn't look good. Daniel! Daniel! Daniel, boy! Can you hear me? Oh my god. Cassandra. You don't look good. It is you. You're alive. As are you. I'm so glad I found you. It doesn't look too good though. No. They put a, a demon inside me. It's tearing me up. What? You can't be possessed. That's impossible. I'm not possessed. They fed me things. I can feel it growing. Can we help him? Can we do anything? I don't know. This thing inside him. The Lord Seeker. You have to find him. Of course we'll find him. If he lives, we'll... Lucius betrayed us, Cassandra. He sent us here. One by one. An important mission, he said. Lies. He was here with them all along. He's still working with them. But we, yeah, we did meet the Lord Seeker though. But we met Lord Seeker Lucius in Val Royale. He couldn't have been here. That wasn't him. It was a demon masquerading. What? How could that be? The Lord Seeker allowed it. He let the demon take command while he 
came here. Tom. Cassandra, now is not the time for sympathy. Wait. Don't leave me like this, please. Poor lad. You should have come with me. You didn't believe in the war any more than I did. You know me. I wanted that promotion. <coughs> Go to the Maker's side, Daniel. You will be welcome. This poor lad. He's only young as well. Rest in peace, lad. He did not need that. He was my apprentice. I have never known a finer young man. Now we find Lord Sika Lucius. Damn right. Let's get some answers out of him. Okay, let's take that. Oh no, we can't take that for some reason. Okay. Don't worry, we can always come back later. Right, let's go find Lord Sika Lucius and make him pay for his crimes. Can't believe he betrayed the Order like that. Everyone believed in him, everyone trusted him, and now this is what they did. Damn it. Right, let's just get there and uh, take him out. Red tab, lads. Get out of the way. Come on, let's see what we got. Nice. Come on. Swing. There we go. Right, what do you have on him? Some gold coins, okay, that's good enough. Right, let's help you. We're getting close to the location now. Anything else here? No? Right, here we go. Moment of truth. Lord Seeker Lucius. Cassandra, with a woman I can only assume is the new Inquisitor. Damn right. Stand down. Call off your men, or this only ends one way. I presume you know we Seekers of Truth were once the original Inquisition. Oh yes. We fought to restore order in a time of madness long ago, as you do now. And we became proud. We sought to remake the world, to make it better. He looks mad. But what did we create? The Chantry. The Circles of Magi. A war that will see no end. Uh, we are not the same. So you help Corypheus? And Aiden Corypheus is supposed to help? Corypheus is a monster with limited ambition. And your ambition is so much greater. We Seekers are abominations, Cassandra. We created a decaying world and fought to preserve it even as it crumbled. We had to be stopped. You don't believe me? See for yourself. The secrets of our order passed to me after the former Lord Seeker was slain. The war with the mages had already begun, but it was not too late for me to do the right thing. This is not the right thing. What do you think? And this was the right thing. Lord Seeker, what you've done. I know. What Corypheus did with the Templars does not matter. I have seen the future. I have created a new order to replace the old. The world will end so we can start anew. A pure beginning. Join us, Cassandra. It is the Maker's will. No, it's her will and her will alone. Let's just take this guy out. He's mad. There we go. You get over here. There we go. It's for every seeker that you took down and every, per every person you betrayed. You get over here too. Crap. Mr. Wrong, wrong, wrong guy. Okay, seeker's down. Nice. One more hit. There we go. He was insane. He had to be. 
he was. The influence of Corypheus, perhaps? Was he trying to disable the Seekers? So much wasted life, that's for sure. These wasted lives. He could not have destroyed all of us. I won't accept it. Let us return to Skyhold. Okay, fair enough. But first, there's some items we gotta get. So what I think I need to do is... That just says Ice Staff. Well, we can get rid of this. I don't think we... No. Inquisitor's Shield. Let's get rid of that. We don't really need it anymore. Um, oh, what's that? Refined Great Stone. No, we'll keep that. Um, armor. I'm never going to wear that, so I may as well destroy it. Uh, get rid of that too. Heavy Armor of the Dragon. Get rid of that. Okay. That should be enough for I us to get... To see what's in this book of secrets. Fair play. Right. Anything else up here? Let's just have a look. And then we'll head back and follow up with Cassandra back at Skyhold. Right. Let's see. Okay. Don't know what that is, but we'll find out eventually. Right, let's head back. Fingers crossed we can freaking figure out what the hell's going on next. Right, let's catch up with Cassandra. She must be freaking destroyed right now with everything that she believed has just been destroyed. Just can't get over it. I really can't. But the important thing is, you know, we avenged everyone who fell victim to uh, Lucius, and that's the main thing. That is the most important thing to me in my eyes. So, let's go speak to Cassandra. I think she definitely needs some comfort after what happened. Right, let's have a look. How you doing, girl? And then I think we'll end the video here then, guys. I think it's the perfect way to end it. from Lord Seeker to Lord Seeker since the time of the old Inquisition and now it falls to me you seem upset you're right you look drained do you know what the right of tranquility is the last resort used on mages in the circle leaving them unable to cast but depriving them of dreams and all emotion it should only be used on those who cannot control their abilities but that has not always been the case. Is that what the book says? Does the book say it was used for other things? No. As a seeker, I looked into abuses. Mages made tranquil as punishment. What finally began the mage rebellion was the discovery the right of tranquility could be reversed. The Lord Seeker at the time covered it up. Harshly. There were deaths. It was dangerous knowledge, the shock of its discovery in addition to what happened in Kirkwall. But it appears we've always known how to reverse the right, from the beginning. Why keep it hidden? Why keep that knowledge a secret? We created the right of tranquility. I told you of my vigil. The months I spent emptying myself of all emotion, I was made tranquil and didn't even know. Then the vigil summoned the spirit of faith to touch my mind. That broke tranquility and gave me my abilities. The Seekers did not share that secret. Not with me, not with the Chantry, not even with... They corrupt, innit? There's more. Lucius was not wrong about the Order. I thought to rebuild the Seekers once victory was ours. Now I'm not certain it deserves to be rebuilt. Okay, what else is in the book? You said there was more in the book. At some point, power becomes its own master. We cast aside ideals in favor of expedience and tell ourselves it was all necessary for the people. Will that happen to us, Inquisitor? Will we repeat history? 
Never. No, we're nothing like the Seekers. I wonder how much we resemble what they used to be. Your face has been shaken. I don't think I've ever seen you so shaken. I do not think the Seekers have been doing the Maker's work. Not truly. Perhaps we believed it once. The original Inquisition came to be during a terrible time. But now, we harbored secrets and let them fester. We acted to survive, but not to serve. That is not the Maker's work. Okay, how would you rebuild? If you did rebuild the Seekers, how would you do it? I can't be the only one remaining. We will always spread to the winds, and some may still be out there. I would find them one by one. We would all read this book, no more secrets. Then together we would establish a new charter. The Maker's work in truth. But what is the Maker's work? You keep saying that, but what is the Maker's work? There is no way to know for certain. That is why we must seek it out. Perhaps we lost our way because we stopped looking. You know something? She has a good heart. She loves the Seekers more than anything else. And I really do believe she can make the Seekers better. Rebuild the Seekers. Make them better than they were. She, yeah, she can do it. I know she can. Thank you. I could not have done this on my own. Hey, I'll tell you to help you. That was nice. But you know what, guys? I think I'm going to leave you here for today because I was a bit hard hitting. So, we really hope you enjoyed today's video. Please like, comment, of course, support the channel. And I'll catch you all in the next one very, very shortly. So, until then, goodbye, of course. Stay absolutely amazing.